morning, everybody. So it must be really tired night, I believe. And I'm from LG Electronics and Design. And before starting, I really wanted to thank you to Grida and Joan. Uh, here she is. Uh, and I'm really honored to uh, serve the screens to this NFC world from the beginning. So uh, that is the kind of the show I usually managed, the Freeze Art Fair. So I can say, may I coming from Web Zero, kind of the traditional market. So what you're seeing in there is the freeze uh, in the previous year, and we are also doing that. And uh, that is the Bonems, one of the most established auctionary in the world with Christie and Sotheby. And that is the Sachi Gallery, uh, the first digital exhibition. Uh, we managed it with Yayoi Kusama and Banksy at the time, and that was the first freeze art fair. Uh, so when I just, I just clearly remember that two days before, when I arrived here, I knew nothing. My biggest concern is how to spend 10 minutes and what I need to talk in here, and how can I go to my hotel safely. But uh, thanks to you guys, I got to know so many great people in here. And then now I think I feel less lonely. So uh, I'm com now I know the reason I come here because I wanted to know and wanted to hear about your stories. Uh, that's how LG wanted to find our future partner also. One of my greatest memories in digital art is I officially founded the digital art sector at Freeze Art Fair since 2021 with Damien Hurst. Uh, and then after each year and uh, each city, we are collaborating with some old established artists, including, like I said, Yayoi Kusama, Banksy, Wu Fali, and Hwang Gi Kim, the, this freeze also. And then uh, I was able to do this because I think, I believe, from since 2018, OLED screen is not just kind of television. That's what I am doing now. Like, that was the black canvas can reflect so many valuable stories of this era. So uh, thanks to that kind of vision, the world around me, and it changed totally the way I see the world and preserve the world. So through the screen, that canvas, uh, I am uh, currently like talking so many stories to the world. And then uh, at the time, uh, at the same time, when I was starting the business, I was so lucky to collaborate with the Van Gogh Museum, the first ex immersive exhibition. Uh, in collaboration with like Van Gogh Museum, like I said. But uh, after that, uh, at the same time, I love my job, but I so wanted to study. And then, uh, as a Korean, uh, I just have some small dream to coming across the universe and wanted to study at London at the time. Uh, because before I'm getting too much older, I wanted to do something meaningful, wanted to learn about the world, because still I'm nothing, but at the time was more nothing. So, it's a totally different world at the, same, at the time. So anyway, I just decided myself to put in that kind of student position. And to, when I just arrived to London uh, to celebrate my holiday, lockdown just started. The city, whole city just went into the lockdown. And then what I know is how many steps to my refrigerator and also how many steps to Sainsbury. That is also an established brand like LG, I think. That is local convenience store. But one of my best offerings was I needed to call to my mother and grandmother every night and then pretended to be, ah, Jason is fine, he's living well. London is really quite a silent, peaceful city. But during the time I got to know, this small kind of small, tiny screen, through this kind of small screen in my palm, I can able to transport my human worms to the other side of the universe. Uh, so I needed to tell this amazing discovery to LG and Freeze Art Fair at the, same, at the time. But do they listen, you think? Actually, they did listen. And Freeze Art Fair said to me, oh, LG, you are good at selling TV. Why don't you keep just selling TV while you are coming here? And then also, uh, the LG says, like, oh, we are good at selling TV, and I'll stop here. So. Uh, I needed to make some convincing form for that. That is called, I think, I just said, uh, Trinity. You can just draw some kind of triangle in your mind. One edge, top edge, is technology. 
And the second H is story, and the last part is telling. The tech knowledge is for me like a plastic bag, not just kind of cheap plastic bag, Katy Perry's plastic bag, I can say. Like, have you ever feel like stripping to the wind? That kind of is It's a superficial concept. Let's say like, mm, like 5G speed, 5K resolution, and 100 megapixel. Can you vividly imagine it? That's why I needed also partner from your guys. Like, we need some story and some mythology to implement it in real. And also, uh, the story, that's why at the, say, at the time, when I collaborated with Damian Hurst, I wanted to tell this kind of valuable story to the world. Uh, so who is talking about life and death and eternity? So that's how I approached to him. And then now, until now, we have two edges in here. And then we need to deliver this kind of stories really in a nice frame. That's why I needed the freeze art fair. So, uh, like, that's how I deliver that kind of uh, stories to the world. So, hundreds of people working, including me, day and night, tirelessly, like as if we are dreaming of moon traveling, unreachable, unrealistic dream ever. And then, so defining the digital art for me is not just creating the shadow of the original work or the imitating the canvas uh, or making some cool graphic effects. I also like cool graphic effects, but uh, you guys are a storyteller for me, so that's more meaningful than the kind of superficial concept of that. So, but you, you guys can know like uh, the most precious thing in the world usually don't have tangibility at all, I think. Like, also emotions and feelings can overwhelm our logic always, I believe. So, when you, for like, when you fall in love with someone or something, um, I usually make a lot of ridiculous questions. Uh, for example, uh, how can I make you the most happiest lady or guy in the world? Or can't I make invisible, visible for you? Or can you interpret my heart in digital? Or can be a code transferred to a code? So that kind of, with that kind of like, ridiculous questions, while I'm facing that kind of things, uh, we are uh, build our logic and then come into existence each moment, every day, uh, and more innocent and pure, I think. So, and after the daydream, it crosses the boundary and becomes a reality. So, of course, it's time, a new wave, and that kind of creates a lot of doubts and fear. Like, still now, uh, like my UK bank or Korean bank is not accepting my kind of coins, but uh, that's how humanity evolved, I believe. So, I believe this art is kind of the universal poem which can, like, uh, allows your ridiculous question and face existential moment is time and deliver your heart across the universe, lightest, fastest, without any boundaries, only your aspiration. So my presentation is finished, and then also I'm just looking for, and if you guys, until I'm staying here for the last day, so if you wanted to tell your stories, feel free to come to me and let me know your interesting stories. Thank you very much.